his election campaign in 2014 till date whether we talk about manipur and past history you were there you were elected by the people of manipur to create a new history for manipur and what you've given to them is 100 days over 100 days of violence communities absolutely divided women being paraded naked women being raped and you have a totally insensitive chief minister and an insensitive government at the center not even attempting to heal their wounds and that is the unfortunate part so you can keep talking about blaming the congress forever till kingdom comes but the point is just this what are you doing in the government people chose you they of course they voted out the congress party because of whatever the past history is you were to create a new history for them you have failed the people of manipur uh he further on, on accusing the india block of dividing the very name of the country uh, in, uh he said in bengaluru after congress victory in uh, karnataka elections they performed the last rites of the upa and uh, he had extended his condolences then and he said that uh, uh, he has joined with nda he has joined ia which means for arrogance and they have put dots in between which has divided the name itself actually there are no dots in between the dot sign is mind and how rattled is he with the opposition coming together and actually holding him accountable whether it is in the rajya sabha or whether it is in the lok sabha we saw even dr manmohan singh shibu soren ji come on the day of the voting of the delhi bell so you can imagine how rattled they are and uh, as far as i is concerned the two eyes that he's talking about i think that clearly stands for an inclusive india inclusive india the two eyes so uh, i will continue to say that mr modi uh, and the entire cabinet is totally rattled they look insecure they look uh, they look quite uh, annoyed and they know that uh, india alliance is asking some tough questions of them which they don't have answers to uh, last in a surprising move lok sabha on thursday suspended adhir ranjan choudhury the leader of congress in the house for repeated misconduct pending an investigation by the privilege committee this is the first time that the leader of opposition has been uh, uh, suspended you know these uh, the the government has become so arrogant in its belief that they can trample over parliamentary democracy over constitutional norms by this suspension they have categorically shown that they 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 are absolutely uncaring about uh, constitutional procedures and by uh, suspending him they have also shown and again proved yet again proved that this alliance which is cornering them which brought in a no confidence motion continues to say yes we know we did not have the numbers but we wanted to bring the prime minister to the parliament having done that it is the frustration that is speaking out loud and it is under that pressure coming from the government that uh, uh, the lop has been suspended never heard of before